Hello. Good day. This is your guy, your, your partners in traveling, signing on. I would like to uh, give you some testimony regarding myself, regarding, regarding the title. How did I overcome the insulin? Stay, stay put, stay tuned, keep watching. This year was uh, lives was easy. I'm carefree in everything that I'm eating and I'm doing. Eventually, when this uh, COVID-19 st struck the whole world, I was not so lucky enough that uh, I get affected and I get hospitalized. During those days, I've learned that I got, uh, I, ha I am a di diabetic person. Being a diabetic person, I, I could not accept because uh, I was being informed by some friends before that I'm already having the signs, the signs of uh, a diabetic person such as having to drink too much at night having to take a urine or peeing at night and uh, there's a there's an observation by my wife that when when I pee on the on the toilet you see some men they some they are carefree there there's some residue of pee on the sides of the toilet before there was no ants but when I, I pee there's ants that are coming so meaning that my, my pee is so sweet but I ignore everything I just keep doing the, the same normal things that I did before that I do before come COVID time I learned that I already have I'm already a diabetic person, not just a simple diabetic person, but a heavy diabetic person. After I came out from uh, from the quarantine, the first thing that I eat are fruits that my favorite fruits. I love it. But uh, curiosity strikes me that I have to buy this. Uh, small gadget to read my sugar counts every day but I was uh, struck that my reading was al al almost 450 480 on my first uh, testing what I did is that I got scared I'm scared for not for my life not only for my health but for my family what I did is that I have to seek I have to look avenue how to remedy or lesson or some say they can uh, person can reverse the effect of uh, diabetic uh, two type type 2 diabetic type 2 diabetes there are some questions that uh, people are asking me like do I know before that I am a diabetic person no 
I don't know. I don't know that I'm a diabetic person before. That's why I eat carefree. I eat a lot. For example, when I I want to taste tea, I put four cubes of sugar. Yeah, four cubes of sugar. When do I know that I am a diabetic person? Precisely when I got hospitalized by COVID. I was stuck dead when I learned that I am a diabetic, not a simple diabetic, but a severe diabetic person. Why did I tell severe? Because you know my first reading? 480, 450 for the complete month it's coming like that I don't know what to do so what did you do when you know when when you learn you're a diabetic person what I did was uh, I opened my laptop I opened my cell phone I checked the YouTube on the subject of diabetic what food what fruits what vegetables what to do how to reverse the type 2 diabetic person and I follow it to the letter really I follow it is it hard to focus on the new system of food habit yes it's very hard before my my my, my learning of uh, I'm a diabetic person I love to eat rice white rice I love to eat uh, sweets chocolates we call we, we have a, a cake in the Philippines named uh, leche plan I love to eat this one but because of I've learned this uh, dip, I'm a diabetic person I refrain from eating all of this so it's, it's very hard it's part of my daily daily routine eating this one where do I get all the knowledge regarding eating and uh, the bad and the good foods YouTube if you want to ask anything if you want to know anything, go to YouTube. They have all the answers underneath, under the sun. All things under the sun, they have the answers. It helped me a lot. It helps me a lot. Really, I was uh, very grateful to YouTube. But some, some contents were conflicting. Some say that this is not this is not good. This is bad for your diabetic uh, cholesterol uh, like that. And uh, some say it's bad. Some say it's good. Some say, but it depends on you on how you are going to comprehend or you are going to understand things that they are saying. What drives you to stay focused? Very nice question, and I will give you a very nice answer. Number one, I'm still young. I'm only 51. Being 51 is just uh, I have learned a lot, I have known a lot, but I have a lot of things I've never been experienced that I want to. That I never learned that I want to. Most probably is to play with my grand grandsons, grandchildren. I want to play with them when I finish my uh, career working I want to see the rest of the world that's why and primarily what keeps me focused is that I love my family I love them dearly that I have to keep my health fit I love them dearly that I have to to be strong to be focused that's why 
I keep on doing drinking the medicine when even it is very hard you know what kind of medicine that I'm taking insulin I'm taking insulin from left to right shoulder from left to right belly from left to right hip it's all been part of my insulin uh, uh, point it's very hard sometimes the the, the, the the thing that I I'm think I'm thinking of taking the medicine again it drives me crazy it's it's kind of wow again like that so what is my status now yesterday I went to my doctor the doctor who told me that I, I have this uh, that I am a diabetic person and the doctor who sees my uh, monthly report my monthly progress we did one uh, again one laboratory test last week ago and what we find out is that very amazing I'm insulin free now I just need to continue my tablet medication but uh, I'm insulin free yeah amazing yeah amazing right what word to all the diabetic person out there what word I can give to the person of the in the, of diabetic diabetes a simple word focus focus on your family not for yourself not for your health but for your family because when you're focused on your family the proof is that you will focus for your health and for yourself have a good habit of eating the right foods exercise if you can do it by uh, by an hour do it by uh, I mean it it doesn't mean that uh, you are working in your your work you're exercising no it's different thing two different things working and exercising are two different things so you have to exercise you have to do some regimen that will keep yourself stay focused on loving your family and there's one more thing that I would like to share to you regardless of your religion regardless of your belief pertain, pertaining to God always remember that there is God that you have to pray for to pray to you have to pray to your God I have to pray to my God we have to pray to God because there is there is a God that will going to hear and answer all our prayers and thanks be to God that he answered my prayer of reversing my using of insulin I may still have a diabetes but uh, it's more less than my usual you know from 480 after a month it's become 300 plus after a month it become 200 plus you know my reading now I'm averaging 90 85 to 95 daily because of the regime food regimen that I did and the attitude of eating the right the right food guys the only thing that will drive us to do this is by loving our family family first but if you if you think that you just love yourself I don't know if you will succeed family first and God will do the rest thank you Thank you for your uh, 
continuous uh, watching of my uh, vlogs I hope that uh, I have given you some inspiration some uh, good testimony remember all foods are good all foods all fruits are good but some will cost you something will bring you something not necessarily you like so keep in what keep in watch check the foods that you're eating if it is necessary or not and take care remember subscribe to those uh, to those all of you who are not yet subscribed to my channel please click the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you are notified if there's a new uh, videos uploaded and please click the like comment uh, like buttons and put a comment I hope that you will going to comment something on this regarding whether you believe or not what uh, what kind of uh, reaction that you hear from from my testimony please kindly put the comment section thank you and may God bless us all Hello. thank you for watching my blog please keep on watching and subscribing if you are not yet subscribed and also subscribe to your